Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, my name is Oloibube, or you can call me Miracle. I'm a Nigerian travel vlogger who recently relocated to Ghana. I promise you guys that I will do a lot of experimental video for you guys. For those who want to relocate to Ghana or visit Ghana, I want you to have a first-hand experience of Ghana through my lens. So, um... I've been discovering a lot of beautiful places in Ghana. Most importantly, I've been discovering a lot of places who look like Nigeria. Like when you enter the place, you go be like seeing a Lagos, Nigeria. One of that place is a place called Circle in Accra, Ghana. Another place is this place, guys. This place be like Lagos Island. Do you know Lagos Island? And this place look like if you're in, if you're not a nigerian there's a popular market one of the biggest markets in lagos it is called lagos island or lagos mm, surprising right so guys if you're a nigerian let me explain this market to you like this market is just like lagos island it is called accra just the way lagos island is called lagos if you're living in mainland lagos you know that um Lagos Island is often referred to as Lagos. This is also how Ghanaians refer to this market. This market is called Accra. So when I came to Ghana newly, um, Mary promised to take me to this place. Like she said that when I get to this place, I'll see a lot of things, a lot of Nigerian uh, food stuff. But let's how we did not go to the market. We uh, head to smaller market close by where I live. So on my own, I enter a bus one day and the bus was calling Accra. Accra. I'm like, okay, let me just go to this place. And guys, as I step in, in this place, the feeling I have is the kind that kind of feeling you have when you step in um Lagos Balogo Market. So this place is the place where they sell a lot of things. They sell things in wholesale here. They sell mostly clothing items here. I see a lot of uh, fabric, like raw fabric, and also um other items they sell things in wholesale price here just like the way they sell things in lagos island if you walk through the inside the market you see a lot of people who are hawking like osafia those who they go carry boss they tell you you won't buy boss you won't buy clothes i'm like wow this is the first time i, I see Ghanaians doing such a thing because all the market I have been to i don't see them calling or dragging person but don't be deceived they know they're aggressive as those if we did lagos island and as i got into this market i'm like mm, it would be nice if i thought this market for you guys and i just enter a cab from where the bus dropped me and tell the cab to drive me around the market so if you're watching this video you may not see a lot of uh, like uh, shops but guys there are many shops here there's a video i film while walking but guys i don't like i, I have a, i use a phone to film so sometimes i don't feel um um secured filming in a public place with phone also there's no Ghanaian that that escorted me to the place i went to that place basically on my own so that is the reason why i wasn't um that's a uh, free filming with my phone i hope you can like get a lot of um information from the videos like this so if you go to ghana or you are in ghana or you visit ghana and you want to buy some things like ghana fabric do you know that ghana fabric i think this is the place you get it they said those fabrics here in wholesale price a lot of things are sold wholesale price here if you walk around the market you see people offloading things from container from um, big big motors so guys a lot is happening here another thing i, I noticed is that in as much as this place is very crowded it's not noisy honestly it's not noisy so guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll leave you to enjoy the rest of the video while listening to a beautiful music and if you enjoyed my content please um share my content with your friends and family subscribe if you have not subscribed it is very very important you give my video a thumbs up each time you're watching my video remember youtube will not know that i'm doing something here if you just watch the video without liking it so please like the video share and also leave a comment below if you're Ghanaian watching this please if there's an information or information that are left behind please can you kindly leave it in the comment section so that other people who are not Ghanaians can understand the market and also if anybody wants to come to this place to shop or buy anything, they can 
come. My own is, all I observe is that if you get to this place, you see a lot of wholesale prices. If you're coming to Nigeria, you may not have the need to buy uh, stuff in Ghana, like um, clothing in Ghana, because you have a lot of it in Nigeria. However, if you want to buy anything Ghanaian, like those Ghanaian beautiful fabrics, this is the place you get it. Be sure to come here and explore. Even if you don't want to get it, the place is just very beautiful. It has a very beautiful um, scenarios. You can just come here, explore the place and have a beautiful experience as a Nigerian or as non ghanaian in Ghana. Guys, I want to point something out. I just discovered that I often call Nigeria and Ghana. <laughs> Guys, please forgive me. If you're watching this and you're not a Ghanaian or you're not a Nigerian, please forgive me. Uh, it seems like I only represent Nigeria and Ghana in most of my video, but please just forgive me. Know that I'm just starting up. I will try as much as possible to make sure that I represent everybody in my video. But guys, please, no matter wherever you come from, you need to come to this place, explore the place and see things by yourself. When I was young and so naive Falling into love like such a fool Yeah, I was dumb, but she was me It broke my trust, and honestly I never want to feel that hurt again I'm so dumb, breaking down my walls for someone To break me till I fall apart Loneliness is not that hard I'm in the market. So this market is like Lego Island. This is uh, Accra market. So guys, this is the video I told you that I filmed while walking. So as I was walking through the market, I said, let me film the video while walking. But it seemed like it's not working because my camera was shaking badly because I was very, very anxious of people uh, telling me not to film. And also, I don't like putting camera in people's places. I feel like it is very, very disrespectful. And again, a lot of people don't like it. So this is the reason why I love filming why I'm in, in a car. Because if I'm filming, you not know that I'm filming. But if you see someone uh, in the random person in the market carrying camera filming, it seems somehow this is the reason why I feel very uncomfortable walking through this place. And my camera was doing boogoo boogoo. Guys, do you see this plaza? It looks like... No battle. No. Hey, Chami, come on. Come on. Come on, Chami, come on. Chami, come on. How much? How much? How much? No problem. After. How much did they sell? This one. Two eight. So, guys, this place is like Lagos Island. They sell everything you want. Everything. Wholesale fry. Sorry, ma. 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 So, guys, as in, ever since I came to Ghana, I've been taking a lot of risk getting content. Guys, because I'm in the market and people they say, Why are you filming in the market? Oh, I just want to capture this place for you guys. And yeah. Guys, this is this, mar this, is this part. Looks like Lagos Island. Good 
say. So <laughs> I'll go, go enter taxi now. I want to board the taxi so that I can film around the market well. Close your eyes.
Remember when you said it doesn't get better than this. Only a fool to let you go. It got into my head. Am I?